again, I'm Rahanna and we are playing more of Gakuen Heaven 2. We are continuing on Joker's version of the common route. So this next scene is going to be immediately after the ball tournament when Yuki goes to wash up in the bath. As you can see, Yuki is excited about taking a bath. Hmm. There's no one here. Am I too early? But it's kind of weird that there's no one here at this time. Why isn't anyone here? Did I make some sort of mistake? Well, whatever. I love how that's Yuki's decision for everything that doesn't make sense, or he can't quite puzzle out, or he's just like, this doesn't seem right. Whatever. Yeah, still singing the song about the nice big bath. Maybe I have it all to myself. God, he's cute. Look at this dork. <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> Who is it? Answer the question. If you don't. Um, I just came to take a bath. I don't mind Hayato. Is it okay? Let's check out these hot boys. I'm not really sure on what planet towels that low are legal, but whatever. This is the best you're going to get in this game, so you may as well enjoy it. I'm just telling you. Nice. Alright, so it's Joker and Sonda. Oh, Chiba -san. And Chiba. Let's let's not leave out Chiba. Let's check him out too. And I guess you could check out the nice bath in the background too, but pretty much no one's looking at the bath, right? Anywho. Uh, it really makes it kind of hit home how, how tiny and scrawny Yuki is if you uh, compare him to the rest of these guys. Well, he covered your head with a wash tub. And, you know, I keep saying this to, to my wife, too. I'm like, how, how is Sonata so buff? What the hell is he doing all day? And she's like, oh, he's, like, lifting heavy pots and pans and stuff. And I'm like, I cook a lot. I move heavy pots and pans around my kitchen. I'm not buff. Whatever. Because this is a fantasy world, and that's just the way it is. So, smile and enjoy it. Well, it suddenly got dark. I wonder what had happened. But why? Did I do something wrong? No, you didn't do anything wrong. Well, it's rare that someone else comes in during our bath time, so Hayato was on guard. Oh. Yeah, I see. Oh. Joker doesn't have his eye patch. Well, it's only natural he would take it off to take a bath. Hmm? Hmm? What is it? Are you fascinated by my nakedness? I know I am. That's not it. Don't stare. Huh? I wasn't staring. Really? Hayato, you don't have to bite like that. But I love how he just gets him to stand down. He really is like a like a puppy. But he's gonna stare at you anyway. Oh, he stayed quiet, but he's still watching me. He looks like a dog that's been told to stay. Exactly. He really does. Anyway, let's hurry up and get in the bath. You catch a cold. <laughs> Sneeze. Hold on, eh? See? Uh, uh, hi. Well, somehow I missed the timing to ask about what's under the eye patch. That's too bad. Don't worry about the eye patch thing. We will definitely find out about that. All in good time. Alright, everyone's in the bath. Oh, it feels nice. So here's here's everyone in the bath. 
cute bath scene. Notice Joker's back. I'm sure you did. I mean, it's incredibly obvious. I like how Chiba's kind of flushing a little bit in the bath, just like Yuki. They're both very cute. They're all cute. They're all cute, seriously. Anyway. Well, it's been a while since there, we've had four people in the bath like this. Sorry about Hayato before. Ah, yeah. Oh, it's fine. Hayato wa boku no kore o shirare nai yo ni shite kurete tan da yo ne. Well, he does that so no one finds out about this. Kore? This? Kiyo no senaka ni wa share ni nara nai mono ga aru kara ne. Well, that thing on Kiyo's back is no joke. Share ni nara nai te senaka ni nani ga. What? What's on his back? Oh. Oh. Sukoi kizu. Sore dou shitan desu ka? That's a huge scar. What happened? <laughs> That's pretty cool, isn't it? Huh? Huh? That's not really at the level of cool. It's not a cut, and it's a little different from a burn scar. You don't look like that. Sorry. Well, don't you think it's cool? It makes you seem like some sort of veteran soldier? Um, I like how poor Yuki just doesn't know what to make of Joker. Joker's just so nutty. You think so too, right? Yeah. I think he's backing away slowly. Well, I guess I'm surprised. I didn't think you'd have a scar like that. So that's another mystery to, to add to Joker's pile of mysteries. You know, what's, what's with the eye patch? What's with the scar? And are they related? Well, I didn't really intend to hide it. But... I can't forget but before I knew it, everyone around me just started treating it like an untouchable taboo subject. So, you know, every, every, all his friends are like, whoa, can't, can't let other people know about this, right? What? That's, that's it? I always thought you didn't want anyone to know about that scar. I'm the same. Not really. Oh, I didn't say anything about it, and there's no problem if everyone knows. What? Well, that's a waste of care. I thought you'd ordered Hayato to keep people away so no one would know about it. Well... Well... Well, I wasn't instructed to, but I thought maybe you didn't want it to become gossip. So these these two have been keeping Joker's secret, and he didn't even care. <sighs> oh, idiots. <laughs> oh, so that's what you were all thinking. <laughs> well, that's what I'd think if I saw that scar. <laughs> Well, because of that, we've taken all these unusual precautions and we don't let other people come into the bath at this time. そっか。I see. Well, that's why it's always like it's reserved for me when I come in here. Well, it is comfortable this way. Well, normally, if someone saw that scar, they'd back away from you. It's at the level where looking at Kyo's scar makes Hayato's scar seem like it's nothing big. So, interesting little tidbit. Chiba has a scar too? It's on his side, take a look. Oh, it's true. That's not a big deal. And now we get an option here. 
where we can ask Joker about his scar, we can ask Chiba about his, or we can ask Sonoda, hey, do you have any scars? But because we are pursuing Joker, we are going to ask Joker about his scar. So, Joker, how did you get that scar? Does it have anything to do with the eye patch you wear all the time? So Yuki has also made the connection. I mean, it's pretty obvious, right? If he's wearing an eye patch and if he has other injuries, it seems like it would be obvious that they were related. Since I first met you, you've always been wearing it. I thought maybe if you had pink eye or something, it would have healed by now. Could it be you've been wondering about it the whole time? Yeah. Well, then you should have asked about it. Well, somehow I missed my chance. Maybe because no one else in the school brought it up, it made it hard to ask. So Yuki's just so polite. He won't ask about anything, won't poke at people if he thinks that it would be improper, they wouldn't like it. Well, usually. I mean, I can't really say that because Yuki is a giant busybody, but I guess certain things just seem to be so private that he won't he won't touch them. And I guess someone's someone's eye patch, you know, if, if someone's got pink eye, well, that's embarrassing. And if it's something more than that, well, maybe they don't want to remember that weird thing that happened to them. And well, I thought just like you said before, it was kind of like a taboo or something. Mm. Hmm. Oh, he got silent, so maybe I shouldn't have asked. So Well, this is a good opportunity to tell you the truth about it. Because keeping silent about this is painful. Now the music has changed. Something painful? Well, to tell the truth, I still haven't told even Eiji or Hayato. Do you want to hear it? Yeah. <laughs> and this is Chiba. Chiba goes gulp over there in the background just as much as Yuki does. Well, it's a story from when I was still young. I told you my roots are Russian, right? I feel like you mentioned it when I went to change the lights that one time. Actually, my grandfather worked for the secret police as a spy in the former Soviet Union. Spy? A spy? But during the collapse of the Soviet Union, he had too much inside information and he disappeared along with his family. And when we were captured, we were horribly tortured. <laughs> Poor Shiba. That's terrible. Even though you were still a child and they gave you... They hurt you so badly that you still have a scar even now? I never imagined you had a past like that, so poor Chiba, because he's so devoted to Joker. Like, this is just killing him, killing him to hear this. Um, I'm sorry to interrupt while you're all excited, but... Well, I understand Hayato, but did you actually study your history lessons? Huh? Kyo, stop with that sort of serious joke. These boys are honest, so they actually believe it. A joke? What do you mean a joke? <laughs> Calm down and try thinking about it. What year was the collapse of the Soviet Union? So, 1991. Well, Kyo wasn't even born yet. 
Uh, and this is where I need to kind of hop in here and point point things out. If you look at the the little calendar pop-ups that come up between the days in this game and you compare them to historical calendar stuff, you know, if you go on like one of those time and date websites and you look up, you know, whatever this, this day is May 27th, I don't know if it's like a Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday, or whatever. But if you do a search for that, you find out that the year in the game calendar, it can only be 2006. There is no other year, you know, recent that's not in the future and not too far in the past for this game to actually have taken place. So 1991 is only 15 years ago per 2006. But as a second year student, Joker has to be 16. So there is a problem with the calendar in this game. I think they actually intended it to, to be um, 2012 because it's only one day off the calendar that way. And it makes more sense because of other things that you see. Like someone someone actually, you see the interior of someone's car at some point in this game. And I actually looked it up um, and we figured out exactly what kind of car it is and what model year it is. And it's after 2006. So obviously something's wrong with the game calendar, but I'm not really sure what year this game is supposed to be set in. But it's obviously more recent than 2006. If, if Joker wasn't born yet, it has to be at least one year later than that. So, I don't know, and I don't really know what to tell you, but you'll just have to take it the way it is and just, just go with it. But anyway, yes. So, Joker's story is bullshit because he was not even born at the time that he is talking about having been tortured. Anyway, it's his usual joke, so don't believe it so honestly. Oh, oh you gave it away. I wanted to see how far I could deceive him. I was completely deceived. Me too. Well, when you talk, I feel like even when something that's absolutely impossible... I kind of feel like it might be true. So then what's the real reason? For what? For the scar and the eye patch. Oh, about that, huh? Hmm. Well, if we get a little closer, I'll tell you. Until then, it's a secret. I knew it. Even though he said he wasn't really trying to hide it. I guess there's something about it. But if he says so, I'll wait until he tells me, so... Nice to see Yuki respecting the privacy of others for once. Well, anyway, it's nice I can use this big bath, but... Isn't it lonely with just the three of you all the time? Not really. But I think I would be lonely. Well, you weren't really trying to chase other people out, right? So why not try explaining to them instead? The bath might be more fun with more people. I don't know, it looks kind of crowded with just four, but you don't know how much bigger this thing is back in the direction that we can't see. I'm not doing that. I like the way it is now. Yeah, me too. I don't have any problem with it. Really? What about Chiba? It's better with fewer enemies. She's giving, giving Yuki kind of the evil eye here again. Ah, uh, mm. Well, it's my bad for asking you, I guess. Well, since you're in the student council, you may want to be friends with everyone, but... I don't really want a Duroc that's friends with everyone. The distance we have now is perfect. Are you saying it's best to keep your distance? So. That's right. Well, 
by keeping it mysterious, it's interesting to let people imagine whatever they want. <laughs> But having you intrude like today is also a bit fun. But I don't care about anyone else. It's fine if you want to come to the bath at the same time as us again. Thanks. Alright, then I'll come again at this time. After all, I want to be friends with the people in Duroc. So that's, that's interesting. Found out a little bit... A little bit more about Joker. There's there's a little more than just the eye patch going on there, and also he he seems like keeping his distance from others. So even though he is extremely popular and gets along with a lot of people, he still doesn't want to get super close. And at the moment, he doesn't consider Yuki close enough to let him know what the, the real story behind the eye patch and the scar are. But. We will definitely find those things out, and it won't it won't be too too long before we get to to find out that very interesting story. So it's it's something very nice to look forward to. It's kind of unexpected. So I hope you'll hang in there until next time. And for now, this is Rahana, and I'm saying goodbye. Thanks for watching. <laughs>